What, what's the, what do you think of the place? What do you think of the setup here? It's a great vibe. Um, you know, everyone that I've talked to has been very welcoming, and um, I can't wait to get out here and actually be able to get to work with these guys. Uh, looks like they're putting in a lot of good work. Uh, coaching obviously has been has been great, and um, I can't wait to, to get out here and, and get to work. Your dad said yesterday that uh, in the house he's, he's dad, on the field he's Coach Hardy, yep. and, and, uh, and that you understand the difference. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah. And, but because you, you uh, went through this in, in high school a couple of years, right? Yeah, in high school. So you know what it's yeah. like to play for him. Yeah, in high school he coached me two years, so, you know, I know this relationship, and, uh, you know, we're able to communicate well on and off the field, so, you know, it's nothing new. He's going to treat me just like every other player. It's going to be no favoritism. And, um, you know, I'm, I'm just happy that I can spend my final year learning more from him. It has to be that way, right? Or it would be awkward for your relationship with the other line. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. And, uh, you know, it has to be that way. You know, on the field, he's Coach Hardy. And, uh, you know, I'm just, I'm just happy that I can learn from him and uh, as a player. Now, here's a question for you. Because we learned yesterday you're not technically Hardy Jr. Oh. Because you guys have different middle names. Yep, you have yep. four names, I believe. Yep. And he is he's <laughs> Hardy Otto. Yep, yep. And you're Hardy William Lindsay. Hardy William Lindsay, yeah. Okay. Um, so what should we call you? And more importantly, what should our headline writers call you? <laughs> Do people call you Hardy Jr.? Do they call you some, Young Hardy? What do they um, call you? It, it all depends. You know, some people call me Hardy Jr. It doesn't bother me. Uh, yeah. My family... And, and close friends, they call me H2. Uh, H2. H2. That's kind Boom. of my nickname. Uh, that's what my dad calls me. Um, Young Hardy, I, you can call me that. You, any hard, just Hardy is not is fine. Um, but yeah, you answered anything. Anyway. Yeah, that's pretty cool. When did you start thinking about that, doing this? It was this to go back to when your dad got hired, or was it long after that? Uh, well, when my dad got hired, I was you know not even thinking about an opportunity like this. Okay, and, you know I was. I was, you know, I've, I've said this. I told our cow people this. Um, you know, I have, I have no ill will towards them. And, sure. And um, it was a great situation over here, just moving on to an even better situation for me. Um, so, you know, I, I was thinking about it, thinking about it. Probably, I'd say about two weeks ago. And uh, you know, probably last Sunday was when I finally made up my mind, and I was like, I have to take advantage of this opportunity to, you know play in this system, play for my dad, play for Coach Lovey, and then also get a master's degree. Sure. And, uh, you know, be able to further my education. You know, my family has a, my mom went to, my mom has a master's, my sister, my uh, twin sister, she's in New York getting her master's in okay. design. And uh, my older sister's about to do law school. So, you know, it's- You guys are a bunch of at, dumb, dumb at, athletes. <laughs> We're a, uh, the bar high academically. Yeah, we're we're a scholar family, so you know I definitely want to take advantage of the educational piece. How old were you when you first met Lovey? Uh, shoot, uh, when when he first got to Tampa, uh, probably probably like two years old. Oh, really? He's, okay. Always he's, first he's time. Known first time. Yeah, he's known me. He's known me since uh, he was my dad's linebackers coach in Tampa. But uh, no, I remember going to training camp when. My dad was uh, with the Bears, and I was able to tag along and be a, a little equipment help, and just be able to take that, take that in, watch guys like Brian Urlacher, Lance Briggs. Is that in Bourbonnais? Yeah, in Bourbonnais, and we stayed in the little dorms, and yeah. you know it was an awesome experience. So that's that was kind of like my first real memory of, of spending time with. with did, you, did you meet the Illinois linebackers today? Yes, yes. You met them. Mm -hmm. cool. They've. Uh, Everyone's been welcoming here, and I can't wait. I'm excited, fired up. When did uh, what are you studying? What are you studying now? When you and when do you get done with school? I'm a legal studies major at Cal. Okay. So kind of pre-law, but um, I'm gonna come here and do the uh, RST program. Okay. Uh, master's program, and I have to take two summer classes, and then I should be out here. Uh, Probably after July Fourth. Okay, so you won't, won't spend the whole. I was joking with your dad. Asked, "Is he moving in with you guys?" He said, "No, no, you're getting your own place. You're on your own." Oh yeah. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> you know, <laughs> I don't want to. He's been in Tampa, and I've been in California. So, I'm, my normality is just having him kind of call and, and text. So, sure. you know, being with him every day is going to be a, a change, and uh, I'm excited for it. But I don't want it to be too overwhelming where I'm. Um, 
been into the house and all that. He said he had resigned himself to the idea of not seeing your senior year, which sounded like something he was really disappointed about. How, much, how cold is it that that gets soft? You know, oh. it goes, oh, it's going to be different parts of the world. It's awesome. Yeah. You know, um, I know last year when he was in Tampa, he was staying up all odd hours of the night before sure. their games, watching our games with the time difference and all that. So it's just, it's just great that he's able to to watch me play and, and be at every game. Um, you know, last year he was only able to come to one, so it definitely means a lot to me and think, my family. Think the back back twelve is happy you're gone. Uh, <laughs> I'm sure the other teams are. Yeah. Um, you know, it's it's a hard goodbye to Cal. And, sure. Uh, that program has been great, nothing but great to me, but um, I'm excited to move on to the Big Ten and. and Playing, playing big houses and uh, I was gonna say, is there a place you would really, really want to go that you get to go to this year? I think everywhere. You know, right, I'm, right. I'm looking at the schedule. I see we play at Nebraska, right? At Michigan, um, yeah. I think at we play uh, at Wisconsin, right? We play Michigan State here, right? Like, you know, big games you see on ESPN every week, and so uh, 